That might be a little too athleisure. Oh, he got you. So it's only my third day out here as a compass agent. Uh, one of the most techno technologically robust real estate companies probably ever worked for. Um, we're out here in Houston, Texas. Let me introduce you to my team lead and his lovely wife now. Erica. And Mr. Eric is not present. focus on my face a little better come on. Hold on like I said guys it's only my third day out here but we got to set ourselves apart somehow some way uh, if you're comfy in front of the camera as a real estate agent sorry e. Oof. looking good e. all right guys so I mean we're gonna start a little series here. I just started as a compass agent here uh, a couple of days ago, and it's one of the most technologically robust countries that, or companies, sorry, that I think I've ever worked for. Um, I would get into myself, but I kind of just want to show you how the day is gonna go. So yeah, we can get this up and running here. My team lead and mentor wasn't here when I first walked in the office. He has a dad joke for you guys. There's no dad joke. <laughs> it's just my, my fit. Show the moves, show the moves, show the moves. <laughs> in the beginning, these videos won't be too entertaining, but I got a surprise for you guys on Tuesday. Um, Cause I'm really just setting everything up right now. This isn't my first stint in real estate. This is, I've been in there for five years now. Um, this is just my first uh, experience with Compass. Uh, they're probably one of the best um, brokers worldwide, I would say. And I'm very excited to uh, keep getting better here. Right now, my days are just consisting of reading reports and trying to cultivate client relationships. And the best part of it is shooting social media. Complications arise, but we figure it out as we go. Experience is the best teacher. It won't let me do cinematic. Um. So like I said, sorry about that. Like I said, the goal is not only to show you guys what our day-to-day -day is like as a real estate team, but also to educate you on the real estate market as well as entertain uh, as often as possible. Let me put you guys down real quick. I said this a little bit earlier in the video, but uh, this isn't my first stint in the real estate industry. I've been in the real estate industry for five years now. I'll tell you more about my story as the videos come out. Uh, the main goal is to take my experience that I had within the real estate industry and make your guys' experience a lot easier. Uh, there was a lot of hardships in the beginning, but I mean, I wouldn't be where I am right now if uh, those hardships didn't happen, you know? Uh, it really comes down to just how prepared you are and how proactive you can be at the end of the day. Uh, my days aren't structured right now. Like, I don't have anyone telling me what to do. With that being said, what helped me the most was just staying disciplined and having a plan at all times. Um, Kind of just really, really understanding that every task I did had a purpose. And if it didn't have an immediate result, uh, I knew the result was gonna come to me eventually. Um, really big on on just following your, your gut and trusting that instinct, uh, cause that's your second brain there. Um, whenever, like as an entrepreneur, whenever you're going through turmoils or you don't feel like you know when the right Thing is happening or if it's the right decision just listen to what your gut's telling you because that's how you're connected to the higher power there and then everything else will fall into place for you
realistically, could have been a great garbage man. Uh, I like to believe that you can be great at anything you put your mind to. Um, but I sure am glad I chose to be a real estate agent. A bit too much for the biscuit here. Uh, I had a perfect shot in my head of me throwing some trash away. Placed my camera up here and it fell. The lens broke, but luckily still is functional. Um, but if that doesn't show you the kind of effort I'll put in to all of you, then I don't know what else to tell you. I'll, I'll try not to. Yeah. I'll try not to. <laughs> All right, y'all have a good, y'all have a good one. Be safe. Bye. See you later. And that's my third day out here. The day's not done yet, though. I got y'all. Another day, another victory for the OGs. Nah, I'm playing. But um, no, it was another good day. Like I said, it's only my third day out here. Um, but just in these three days like the experience that led me to this point i'm farther the first three days than i was in like the first six to eight months in my first year you know what i mean it's just because it's it's a matter of i know what to do now right i'm hoping this this little series that i got going will uh will touch people you know just just really really have a story resonate with them because i mean people are scared to be on camera luckily i'm not but uh a lot of people you know they they have a story and they feel like they're the only one going through it. They feel like they're the only person experiencing uh, whatever it is they're going through. Um, so I'm hoping that me sharing my last four or five years and what's to come will motivate, I mean, empower, just just all, all, all those good things, you know? I mean, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna change people, I wanna help people at the end of the day. Um, and that's that's my goal here. That's, that's fully what I intend to do. Here we go. Oh, 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 oh,